and like that welcome to silent hill 2 again today's an extra special day because it is in fact my birthday and i wanted to celebrate my birthday by playing my favorite game of all time so i'm really excited to be back here again today playing what i started yesterday continuing actually going into my favorite section which is like the end of the apartments beginning of the hospital like that area i think it's just so especially exploring the town i think it's just so cool so we left off and we had this puzzle and we were obviously just like set we had to go we have to explore more of the one the first floor i don't know but yet Uh, of course, we got our favorite bug things immediately. And creepy leg things back. That's cool. Just stand there idly, menacingly. Gonna do anything? We're just gonna stare at each other? Oh, yeah. I didn't check out, but can I. Uh, control options. Can I switch? Can I make these get rid of those and then make where's uh, aim lock? Make this. No? Okay. I tried. Because <laughs> it wouldn't let me use the uh, right trigger yesterday for some reason. It wouldn't let me program it to a controller. Are you going to do anything? Besides... Well, I guess there isn't much you can do because you're not very, like, stable. Like, you're just gonna, like, fall over. Because it's the equal amount of weight at the top than there is at the bottom. So, like, it's... If you move any, you're just gonna fall. Am I, am I dumb for thinking that? That there's equal weight? It's just gonna, like, just tilt? Maybe even heavier. Huh. So... Uh... Try room 108. Broken. Nice puddle effects. Did not know that there was even water on this floor. And just, I don't know. It's pretty cool. Hand stitch is really cool. <laughs> Little things like that makes this version really nice. Things that you would even like pick up on in the regular version. Oh. We're in cutscene room. How fun. Fun cutscene room. Is that a bear? Stuffed animal. Probably belonged to the kid that used to live here. How did you know a kid used to live here? Just because of the stuffed animal? Could be adult stuffed animal. What's that? What is the jar, James? It looks like jam. It's probably a secret to a puzzle later on. No? Okay. Uh. Anything else? What's that? Spray can? Some type? Nothing else interesting in this room besides that door we have to go into, which I really just don't want to. Oh well, I guess we'll see her. I'll take myself off cam for a second. Oh, it's you. Yeah, I'm James. Angela. Angela, okay. I don't know what you're planning, but there's always another way. Really? But you're the same as me. It's easier just to run. Besides, is what we deserve. No, I'm not like you. 
afraid. I... I'm sorry. It's okay. Did you find your mother? Not yet. She's not anywhere. Did she live in this apartment building? I don't know. So, all you know is she lived in this town. What did you say? How do you know that? Well, I just figured, because this is where you're looking for her. How else would I know? Yeah. Am I right? I'm so tired. So, why did you come to this town anyway? I... I'm sorry. Did... did you find the person you're looking for? Not yet. Her name's Mary. She's my wife. I'm sorry. It's okay. Anyway, she's dead. I don't know why I think she's here. She's dead? Don't worry. I'm not crazy. <laughs> At least, I don't think so. Uh, I've got to find my mama. Should I go with you? This town's dangerous. Now I know what you meant back there in the cemetery. I'll be okay by myself. Besides, I'd just slow you down. What about that? Will you hold it for me? Sure. No problem. If I kept it, I'm not sure what I might do. Okay, we got a prisoner coin, there are magazines on the floor, but there's nothing unusual here, and we got cool knife, knife from Angela, I don't plan on using this as a weapon, the blade is stained with something red, probably just Kool-Aid, you know, stuff gets everywhere. That red dye. Um, ooh, spooky. I'm going to strobe the zombies. I know that it's not zombies. They're like ghouls. I'm going to stroll the strobe the ghouls to death. That is what I'm going to do. This is where we came from. Yep. While we're here, we might as well do the puzzle. There's something written on the desk. First lies the seat of who he uh, he who is peerless, silent and empty, heartless and fearless. Besides him sits one who knows the place of the servant. Uh, the place uh, who knows the place of the servant is next to the throne. Dozens of feet, yet a single toe. The one that is hidden beside him doth go. Seducer of dreams, creature of Hades, lighting further from man, closer to lady. Man and woman seeing all, headless to the raven's call. Silent and hidden, the two may be. They might not be there for you to see. Return them to whence they would be, and blessings shall descend on thee. I speak thus with the north star behind me, the birth of the sun in the start of the story. That is a lot. This puzzle is a lot and hard, but I think... 
I don't remember this puzzle, like, the solution exactly, and I know it's different for each difficulty. I th think it said Serpent was a snake. Oh, I can't use that here? Just can't use the coin? What about now? Can I use the coin now? I think it said this, then prisoner, old man. If I had to just rush this real fast, I think it would be old man would be the servant, and then it would be the snake, and then it would be... Probably, I would put it probably here. That did not work. Uh, I'm going to take old man and put him here. And if that doesn't work, I'm just going to reread it. Because I definitely am missing something. Nope, I am wrong. Okay, let's read. Uh, let's take out woman, old man. Serpent, why not? Take them out. Take them all out. And reread it in the memo. Memo next to corpse one. Oh, these like actually like save in your memos. I didn't know that. Because I didn't. This is the first time I actually read them all, I guess. These corpse messages that we got last time. First lies the seat of he who is peerless. Silent, empty. Oh, old man would be. The first one, then. Besides him, since one who knows the place. The one who knows the place of the servant is next to the throne. That capitalization throws me off. Um, okay, I think I get it. No, I don't want to read through this again. I want to go back. Uh... No, I don't need to take any out. Is it... This? Nope. Okay. That sucks. Um, further from man, closer to lady. I didn't, I didn't do lady as fourth. So, like, what if I did? There's obviously something I'm missing here. Because I'm a big, uh, big dumb dumb. But, uh. I'm going to try. It's definitely woman goes in front of old man because there has to be a separation to where the snake is closer. Okay. Just making sure that wasn't the answer. Um, I'm going to analyze the Coins, maybe there's some. Yeah, I don't know what any of the text on it says. Oh, it says the same thing for each of them. Old man. Prisoner. Hmm. First lies the seat of who he. Is perilous, silent, and empty. Heartless and fearless besides him since one who knows the place of the servant is next to the throne. Doesn't feet yet a single toe. The one that is hidden besides him doth go. Uh, okay. 
Sushi of dreams, creature of Hades, lying further from man, closer to lady. Man and woman seeing all, headless to the raven's call. Silent hill and hidden too may be, they be not here for you to see. Return them for once. I speak with the North Star behind. Oh, this is probably, I just thought of like, what if I'm putting them in the wrong order? Like I have to flip it. It's probably what the puzzle is. Speak thus with the North Star behind me. So, if North's behind you. You're facing s s south. The birth of this. Oh, the birth of the sun is the story. So, sun's rising is the. Okay. I get it. I think. Um. I'm a big dumb dumb. It is this snake. Woman. Right? Nope. Then it is. So first, I thought maybe it's woman, woman snake. Woman, snake. Man, uh, do that. Hey, got the Lynn House key. Didn't even need to look it up this time. I just kind of, well, you can kind of like force it. There isn't, there's only so many things, but it is a lot of combinations. So, yeah, I feel like a big boy for solving that puzzle. Big boy on my birthday, solving big boy puzzles. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it, but I have a new uh, cowboy shirt uh, that I got for my birthday, and I'm really excited to be wearing it uh, because yeehaw! Did I get all the hall? Did I get all the doors in this hallway? Uh, we got these section down here locked. Up, oh, spooky noises locked. Oh, there's a thing. Hey, buddy. Good thing you fucking suck. Did I miss one? Nope. Oh, I did. Okay, we can go back up. So, we get to go to the Lynn house now. How fun. Am I damaged? No, I don't think so, so. Uh, we gotta go this way. Yeah, so the reason I got quiet there is because this room sometimes, I don't know if it's all the time because in certain playthroughs I haven't gotten it, but there's this one specific whisper that pops up um, and for years people thought it was like cryptic stuff or like something to actually do the story. But, uh, I don't know the YouTube channel, but someone actually, like, found what it was, and it was from a sample pack of something. And it's just some dude listing off groceries. Uh, but in a whispered voice, so it sounds spooky. Since it's so muffled, and you can't understand what it's saying, it, it is creepy. And you're not expecting it, too. So. New save. There we go. 
Apartment. Can't go out the store because it's stupid. Hey, did I get all? No, did not want to do that. Um, I didn't check 204, but I don't think there's anything in it. But just since I'm, I need to have everything checked off on the maps. So that was, was is that 204? No, it's 201. 204 is over here. Okay, so we cleared this floor. Let's go see, uh, Pyramid Friend, shall we? Am I damaged? Yes, I am. I have 130 ammo. I think we're gonna survive, boys. Just barely. Again, that's one of the moments where it's just like, I know this is gonna happen it's just still mind-blowing to me that it I I don't know every time it's just still like this was allowed in a video game <laughs> get good son Oh, that could have been bad. Is he coming towards me? Oh, yeah. Oh, he's going away. We scared him off with my mad seals. He's going for a swim. Just a, just a relaxing little swim. Are you... Are, does it really take you this long to go down? Oh. Pyramid head. Pyramid friend's so nice, he unclogged the bathtub for us so we can walk down it. Anything down here besides the door? Nope. Anything health? So that pyramid head, uh, I guess it is a boss battle. You, he can kill you in one hit, um, with his main attack if you get too close to him. Um, you have to use, you either have to like wait a certain long time and it'll just give up, or he you can shoot him a certain amount and then he'll just give up um i always tend to shoot him because i usually don't use ammo this early in the game because it is just the leg dude the dudes with the butt cheeks and then the leg do things and they don't really you. do much damage the nurses you are more violent me. you're the one who stepped on my hand i don't know maybe i did james the shoots little the little girl anyway End of Silent Hill Mom, 2. Are you blind or something? What's that letter? None of your business. You didn't love Mary anyway. Wait! How do you know Mary's name? Also, how did you get up that wall? That is a big wall. Did you climb up the trash? Or is there like a... Oh, there's a scaff. Oh no, that's a little pretty far. How did you get up there? That is a very tall wall. Ah. 
You could just get on the trash can and eat yourself up there. I don't think that's impossible. Oh, it's down here. Oh, there's actually stuff here. I remember this gate. I always think this gate's so cool. It's like, even though it's like, it reminds me of like a liminal space, just because it's just like, it does it again. It's one of those things. Silent Hill. Silent Hill makes no sense whatsoever. It's not supposed to have like any resemblance to like any logic at all ever. It's kind of like the dumbest thing imaginable at the current moment. Um. This is so. This is that park. Mary, are you here? Oh, I thought there was going to be more. Um... Oh, that's interesting. So, um... This gazebo was in the trailer for the new one. Uh, the new Silent Hill remake by Blooper Team. Uh, in the cutscene we're about to have... I guess takes place in there now, which I I don't think really makes that big of a difference. It's just a minor note thing. I since I played this game so many times, just like the little things I noticed. Mary. No. Do I look like your girlfriend? No, my late wife. I can't believe it. You could be her twin. Your face, your voice, just your hair and clothes are different. My name is Maria. I don't look like a uh, ghost, do I? See? Feel how warm I am? You're really not Mary. I told you, I'm Maria. Sorry, I was confused. Where are you going? I'm looking for Mary. Have you seen her? Didn't you say she died? Oh yeah, three years ago. But I got a letter from her. She says she was waiting in our special place. And that's here? Anyway, I haven't seen her. Is this your only special place? Well, there's the hotel too, I guess. The one on the lake? I wonder if it's still there. Hotel? Yeah, it's still there. So, the hotel was your special place, huh? I'll bet it was. Don't get so mad. I was just joking. Anyway, it's not that way. It's this way. You're coming with me? You were gonna just leave me? No, but... With all these monsters around? No, I just... I'm all alone here. Everyone else is gone. I look like Mary, don't I? You loved her, right? <laughs> or maybe... You hated her. Don't be ridiculous. So it's okay? Yeah, fine.
guess thank you trevor for telling me my mic's off <laughs> i turned it off for the cutscene i thought i turned back on the memory of the 67 who died of illness and now sleep beneath the lake snake coin is actually i think snake coin is actually a real thing i'm not even joking about that snake coin is like some type of bitcoin that like exist i'm pretty sure it sounds like something but again as i said when I, my mic muse uh muted two more people need to die for this to be uh, a perfect tragedy in the memory of the 67 who died of illness and now sleep beneath the lake anything down here I just love how, like, oh no, TJ's here <laughs> in the chat. We can't, we can't allow this dude to be in the chat. We gotta ban him. <laughs> Trevor, you're a moderator. Ban TJ. He's in the chat. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I was not expecting that. That was actually startling. Oh, there's a health drink. Okay. Oh. Oh, I'm dead. Okay, that's cool. Let's use chainsaw because no. Oh, let's not do memos. Let's use chainsaw because I. <laughs> you timed them out for six hundred seconds. Yeah, I think that's an appropriate reaction, Maria. I, I think that... That makes sense. Ugh. Are we any one of the creepy dudes that pops out of the car? Oh no, I'm actually surprised. No, just weird leg things that attack you. We're getting a request from right now in the chat, in the Twitch chat, for Andrew wants uh, Seymour to join the chat. Seymour is, uh, you know who Seymour is, he's an oddity, and uh, I think that would be like a level of domestic terrorism, so we can't allow him in the chat. Did I actually pass the car? I need that pipe. Did I even get that far? Yeah, I way overshot the gas station. And it just turns off. I guess that was the ignition to the car was in the front. Like any good car should be, it should just be right on the hood of the car. Like one of those wind up toys. I want to see if I can get to the fun little Easter egg. If you go all the way out here. Oh, it did it! They're just launching! <laughs> he got eaten! <laughs> I, I don't know why, it's just this one area. They just yeet into frame and it's hilarious looking. Doesn't make any sense. Oh crap. There we go. Am I damaged? Yeah. There we go. Do I need more of them meat if you keep on coming this way? Just like. Yeah, what a good place for an ad. You can only see it. Uh, you can still see it from up. You can only see it like six feet from it. 
I think that's a pretty good spot for an ad. Are we needing more people that get eaten in front of us? Quiet cocktails. Quiet cocktail is just... What is a quiet cocktail? Just absinthe? <laughs> It'll make you quiet? Is lean a quiet cocktail? I saw like an ad today. It's like a like one of those anti-drug ads. And I was like, this is very specific because it was for lean. Like, this girl was on TikTok. Oh, shit. <laughs> Person being yeeted. Uh... Some chick was on TikTok drinking lean. It's like, oh, we're going to drink some lean. <laughs> I'm like, what? this is like way too specific for like an anti-drug ad. Next, you're going to have like, don't take 15 Claritin in a row. Then you're, then you'll be able to breathe too well. Butt hash, but uh, butt hash is actually. If you guys don't know what butt hash is, that's a uh, where you take um piss and shit, and you put a balloon over a mason jar, let it ferment for a little bit, and then oh, what's this? Oh, uh, you let it ferment for a little bit, and then you snuff it to get high. I think that is probably more something teenagers would do with than lean. Excuse me? I'm reading. Okay. We gotta go to the bowl, Rana. Take 16. Butt hash? I don't know if what happened. Take that dude just eat it. That this is great. I'm having a fun time. People are just being yeeted at me, and it's hilarious looking. People just keep on getting yeeted at me. <laughs> they just now they're just dying. Remember when we took fifteen cans of milk to BG and Seymour got his fight with his parents on the phone? Oh, I remember when Seymour forgot like how many cans did he forget of milk? <laughs> it was like. 20 <laughs> he forgot some some just disappeared it vanished he took them all out of the box and needed to inspect every one of them for uh, quality assurance okay it's time to go bowling I'll wait here I hate bowling I didn't come here to play you know hurry back okay Okay. So what'd you do? Pizza what graphics. Incredible. Nah, nothing like that. Huh, you're just a gutless fat though. What'd you have to say that for? I thought you said the cops were out for you. No. I just ran because I was scared. I don't know what the cops are doing. But if you did something bad, why don't you just say you were sorry? <laughs> well, I guess I run away a lot too. Little girl. It's no good. She's no dressed good. like she's 30 no years old. Ever forgive me. I don't I, I'm... She might be an actual, like, adult model. I never thought about this before, and they just shrunk it down. Like, they could have just altered the clothing a little bit, but, like, they just... Maybe if she was intended to be like an actual person, they just like <laughs> the model size down. Never thought about that. It's always nice to have very loud trip hop playing in the background. 
I always like to f like to feel like I'm at a uh, Portishead concert right next to the front speaker. James, we met in the apartment building? Yeah, I remember, but... Are you alone here, Eddie? Um, uh, no. This place is haunted. By really old looking kids. Who are scaled down? <laughs> Let's go after her. Huh? Laura? Why? Laura? Is that her name? That's what she said. This town is full of monsters. How can you sit there and eat pizza? She said she was fine by herself. Yeah, you just gotta trust the kid. Me would just slow her down. Forget you. Kids do perfectly well around uh, ass monsters and lake creatures. And fog. The perfect trifecta. Did a little girl run out of here? Yeah, she was too fast for me. Aren't you gonna go after her? No. I just kinda kinda sit. Cause that girl's been mean to me, so like, there's no. If she dies, she kind of like dies. I really like ethically, maybe I should do something, but like honestly, it's not really any of my business. So, uh... also, wait, there. This parking scenario makes no sense. Unless these are like do not drive lines, but if these are parking spots, like you don't have any room to park. And then they put an AC unit. Oh no, this is crate. Oh, there's, is that health? Nope, it's just concrete. Cool. Trash. And these are parking spots. Can you go around this side then? It's blocked off by a fence. So yeah, these are these right here are definitely parking spots. So maybe it's like these are like do not do not come here unless you're employee lines. I don't know. Silent Hill doesn't need to make any sense, but it should have justifiably good parking. She went through there. Yep, that seems about right. Just random crack between buildings. Is there any other way? Yeah, there is. Right through there. As we saw with like the apartments that were like so close they had to remove the fire escape so you could just literally go out the fire escape door into another apartment. Literally at this point, it's I think Silent Hill permits for buildings are like you can literally make them as close as humanly possible. Stuff like if you have a McDonald's literally within like no good. It's a lot. F like a centimeter of space. It's something else. But it's a separated building. It's not like a mall setting or like a um, shopping center. It's like just two separate buildings really, really close to each other for no reason whatsoever. You gotta use that boob key. It's really a really interesting feature in Silent Hill 2 that Portis Head constantly follows you everywhere you go. Really interesting. Really good feature. Paradise. That looks interesting. Say the least. Heaven's Night. I 
I think this actually won a record for the world's smallest strip club. Because it's just like, you immediately walk in the door, like, there's no buffer. There's no, like, like, uh, what is it? Bouncer? Just immediate boob. Just like... Staircase. Staircase is the buffer, I guess. I guess you could probably have a bouncer right here. That's the crack she got through. Okay, wait. Why is there a wall here, then? There's just trees! <laughs> I've never noticed that before. Like, if it was a building, it would make sense, but now, like, the reason we couldn't go through there is because there was that wall, and the wall's there for nothing. Silent Hill actually isn't just a spooky town, it's just the management of it is just god-awful. Like, their mayor's terrible. He just lets anything fly. There? Silent Hill is home to the last uh, known Ponderosa Steakhouse, and it's uh, three different floors. But you have to like, they're only connected by like fire escape. Brookhaven Hospital. It's nice that the garden, oh is that the garden of the hospital? Is that why there's a gate around? Yeah, you can try to trick me Silent Hill, I know you're... Infrastructure system sucks. As I go through and click all the doors to my heart's content. Don't want to do that yet. Uh... We did the loop. You always gotta do the loop when you're playing this game. Make sure you knock off every individual door. Seems to be about the patients hospitalized here. Jack Davis. He's attempted suicide three times in the past for reasons unknown. Although he's normally a model patient who follows doctor and doctors and nurses' orders, he must be watched closely due to his past pattern of sudden and violent suicide attempts. Joseph Barkin. His illness seems to be rooted in the fact that he believes he's guilty of causing his daughter's death. His symptoms suggest a psychotic break and paranoid delusions. Normally calm, but has tendency towards violence when excited. Joshua Lewis. History of hospitalization as well as nausea. Oh, I thought that was nauseous assault. Numerous assault, battery, and other violent offenses. He's a song, per, uh, he has a song, strong persecution complex and a tendency to solve things through violence. Extreme caution necessary. This sounds like a fun place. When I was committed to a mental asylum, I just solved puzzles with uh, dudes who were there for crack addiction. And actually, no, I think he was there for speed. And like, he was just like, you're taking too fucking long to solve these puzzles. <laughs> that is the only fond memory of the psych ward that I have. Fun times. <laughs> Or no, we weren't playing puzzles, we were playing uh, Scrabble, and I was taking too long for my turn. Fun times. Fun, fun times. <laughs> the potential for this illness exists in all people, and under the right circumstances, any man or woman would be driven like him to the other side. The other side perhaps may be not the best way to phrase it, after all, there's no wall between here and there. There's a wall between this place and the strip club next door. But there shouldn't be. Should be like a gate maybe or or something. Because there's just a weird ass crack that could be maybe potentially an alleyway. But maybe you're separating the mental ward from whatever. I just realized uh, chat's on screen. How did that pop up? Has that been there the whole entire time and I just didn't notice until now? Or has it been doing it the entire thing? I thought I turned chat off for this one. Oop. Oh well. Won't happen anymore. 
I had it the other day when I was streaming uh, Resident Evil on the PS or the PS One because it was like a four three graphic. The other side perhaps may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there's no wall between here and there. It lies in, on the borders. Reality and unreality intersect. It is a place both close and distant. Some say it is even an illness. I cannot agree with them. And I'm, not a do- I'm a doctor, not a philosopher, even a psychiatrist. But sometimes I have to ask myself this question. It's true that to us, his imaginings are nothing but the inventions of a busy mind. But to him, there simply is no other reality. Furthermore, he is happy there. So why am I asking? Uh, so I ask myself, why in the name of healing must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality? I got the key from Joseph. It's probably just the key to that box. That's a weird ass fucking key. We already read this, I just wanted to save. Good. Okay, let's get out of here. Wait, can I talk to you? Is that something I can do? Oh no. Remember that being like a thing in some rooms in this game? I I don't know, maybe I'm just crazy. Oh, I... I <laughs> Thanks, Ashley. I don't know you at all. You're a complete stranger to me, and I'm definitely not wearing... You definitely did not give me this cowboy shirt that I'm currently wearing. <laughs> that notification was actually pretty loud. I'm going to make sure it doesn't... Do that. Is there a way you can lower it? No, it's not in the mixer. There's probably a... Way to nope. I can delay it. That's cool. Can't not make it burst my eardrums. That would be nice, but oh well. It probably is. I just don't have the time or the energy to go through it. That's a good bed. Got the good stains on it. This type right here, I got no use for this. <laughs> Hi, Ashley. <laughs> the girlfriend's in the chat. I gotta say hi. Wait a minute, what's this? There's a sheet of carbon paper still stuck in the typewriter. I can still read the imprint left on it. I know the secret I'll give them. Something to deal with this demon. The shelter is no use of any more. He is of... Uh, he is my instrument. He must be followed... Uh, he must follow my orders. Yes. The box will be useless. Now I must not forget. 2972. That's good. He's the lowest now. I too will be free and he will serve me. I am genius. No one can stop me. One can stop me. No one can stop me. Can stop. Can stop. No, no. Sound that I'm pretty sure that's just the end of a Kanye West song. Probably a more recent one. We got lapis eye key. We got shotgun shells. We got chicken skirt. We got spooky hallway. We got demented nurse. We got hit. We. And then the little step. You gotta do the little step. It's what keep, kills them. It's just a teeny, teeny step. It's all just boop. Oh, I didn't grab the other health drink. Anything else in here I'm missing? I thought...
How patient are these nurses just to wait for them to meet? Just, uh, just for them to wait to kill me or to be killed by me. That's very nice and patient of them. Oh, that one's not patient. This one's not very nice. Oh. Okay, now I'm extra healthy. Uh, we gotta try this door. Can't do elevator. <laughs> Just shoulder checked Maria. <laughs> or Mary. Oh, we were already in here. That that was that was the room with perfectly good bed. I'm taking a lot of damage here. Uh, maybe it's time to bring out. There's something inside the pocket of the white lab jacket. I got the examination room key. I I read that first as exclamation. <laughs> Apparently I can't read it all. Never mind. Don't even just disknowledge what I said because apparently I I never got enough AR points as a kid. Ow! What's wrong? That's what you get for fondling a bear. Myself. Are you okay? Yeah. Got a bent needle. There's a shotgun in the locker. I got a shotgun. How much ammo do I have for it? 12. Probably easier to just use my pistol since I have so much ammo for that. Bullets don't kill, tiny little stomps do. Okay. I got all the rooms on this floor marked off, so let's go back to here and check out the examination room, which is this room? Yeah. There are medical records on the desk, nothing particularly interesting. There's nothing useful. I got shotgun shells. You missed the bowling alleys? Is it because I played constant Porterhead music, Trevor? Is that why you miss it? The constant trip hop stream? Oh, I can easily read that. That's, that's uh, very legible. The pin number this month is T. Last month it was X. And before that it was Z. But what are they going to do next month? That's all they can express with four numbers. Anyway, does the door to the patient wing really need to change? have its combination change this often? So it's... So... No, it's not this. God damn it. So there's 26 letters. Uh, this month is T. So X is 26 letters. X is 20. 
24. Z is 26. I don't know what T is number wise. Um, but maybe we'll get another hint. I would assume T would be... Oh, okay, let's count it out. Let's count it out together. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T. The pin is revealed when you text Big Meat to 68922. No, that gets you a free meal at a city at a city barbecue when you text uh, Big Meat to 68922. Uh, I think it's... Oh, I already lost count. I think it was 15 or... 16, 17. So I'm assuming it's a, you just do the number twice? I don't think that's highly illogical thinking. If you clean your plate at City Beer Barbecue, the pin number is on the bottom. No, that's 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 for the next. That's Silent Hill F. That's what happens to Silent Hill F, but it's a Panda Express. Oh, I'm in a completely different corner. I was like, why, where did the door go? And it's actually over fucking here. I'm just gonna guess 17, 17. And then just work my way up. Okay, I gotta kill these monsters, because this is the loudest music in all of the world. I'm trying to figure out numbers here, and letters, and how they work. Can you please, uh, take your, uh, loud -ass drums and bass and fuck off? Got a first aid kit. Anything else? Uh, locked... Okay. Let's let's count again, shall we? One, two, three, four, five, six. Or not. What? I was just counting this time. I wasn't even doing the fucking alphabet. That shows you how smart I am. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T. I got 15 again. So maybe it's just 15, 15. I just didn't believe myself. Or is it 15, 17? Because it goes up by 2? No. Is there like another number I missed? Oh yeah, I did get a, I did get a number earlier, didn't I? It was... I thought I got a number. The pin number this month is T. Last month it was X. Oh, so it's... It would be... T. I don't understand the pattern. Z. So it's... Y. So it skips over Y. I don't know, maybe it's 12, 12, 11, 11, 11, 11. 
14, 14. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not big boy smart. Let me think about this more. I thought I got a number earlier. Pin lot this month is T. Last month it was X, and before that was Z. That's all they can express was four numbers. Anyway, just the door to the patient. We really need a combination change. That's all. Um, I think I'm missing something downstairs. Get out of the way. Zooey Mama. That is unfortunately not the code. There is neither a Zooey or Ma Ma button, which is very disappointing. Um, did I miss a room back here in this section? Different kinds of memos are hanging up, but there's nothing of particular interest. Right. And that's where the key was earlier. Okay. Well, we can go... Oh, thanks, Blake. Thanks also calling uh, calling me an alpha male giga chat. Uh, I, I don't think I'm any of those things. I think I am uh, just a boy. Just a small, small, small boy. I feel like I'm I think I'm missing I'm missing like like a base code because I thought it was just like leather is the alphabet but I guess I'm dumb I'm going to look this up because I feel like I am missing something and I'm being really stupid. So, uh, Silent Hill Hospital, third floor, door code. Uh, I'm looking it up. That is not what I was looking for. That is Silent Hill 3. That is not the correct game. Oh, I did type in Silent Hill 3. <laughs> Shit. I was thinking of third floor, so I typed in Silent Hill. Oh, it's a. F I feel like a dumbass now. 
Silent Hill P. Yes, that is, that is actually the next game in the Silent Hill franchise. Um, it goes F and then P. Um, I'm kind of glad I looked because I don't think I would ever have gotten it. But it's in the shape, so like it's it went up too far. It's in the shape of the floor code, so it's like it's T, so it would be or it's one, two, three, five. Or it's let me let me one three two eight. Oh, I guess Okay. Locked. 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 Just a hangover. Pretty weird hangover. You should rest. Just stay here, and I'm just gonna. You're gonna be fine. Just so comfy. See ya, Ashley. Love you. Uh, I'm gonna go look for her. For Laura. I'll just stay here season. on the bed in the creepy place. Don't worry about me. I'm definitely not gonna leave you here and never, never come back. Go back out into the nightmare zone. That's how you know you're playing like Silent Hill at an appropriate like volume level where you can't even like think when like any of the combat music's on. Something new right on the wall. Louise, I'll take care of you forever. It's my destiny. Uh, cool. There's some stuff. I got a key. Okay, that did a thing. Um, I got another key. And that's the roof key, right? Yep. Let's go to the roof. Every lock is four. All fours. I think there's actually a puzzle in this game where you just type in four, 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 four. But I can't remember what it was. It just sounds like something that... Let's go to the roof. Roof time! Roof time! You just ever just hang out with your moros on the roof? Something on the floor. Is it a diary? May 9th, rain. Started out the window, uh, stared out the window all day. Peaceful here. Nothing to do. Still not allowed to go outside. 
May 10th, still raining, talked with the doctor a little. Would they have saved me if I didn't have a family to feed? I know I'm pathetic, weak, not everything can be strong. May 11th, rain again, the meds made me feel sick today. If I'm the only better when I'm drugged, then who am I anyway? May 12th, rain as usual, I don't want to cause any more trouble for anyone, but I'm bother either way. Can I really be such a sin to run instead of fight? Some people may say so, but they don't have to live in my shoes. I may be selfish, but it's what I want. It's too hard like this. It's just too hard. May 13th, I, it's clear outside. The doctors told me I've been released, that I've got to go home. I... Diary really ends here. There are no more entries. What is the diary doing up here? It's pretty gated. I don't think you... Oh, uh, you can climb up. There's no bar... Oh, sides have... No, they don't. They just have curved... No barbed wire. Okay, yeah, you could very easily eat yourself off of here if you wanted to. Thanks for coming, Trevor. You didn't have to stay if you didn't want to. Oh, shit! <laughs> Pyramid friend. Pyramid friend yeeted us into the pit. Oh, and I'm fucked up. Seal. I'm still fucked up. I was Omega fucked up. Oh shit. Locked. Locked. No, something runs on the wall. It looks like Joshin. If Joseph looks calm, he can be taken out of his cell. If Joseph looks calm, he can get a, a slice of salami as a treat. Something running on the wall. We're going to go with 4976. Turn, turn, turn the numbers. It's better not forget them. So I'll be right down here. The other one, my secret name. Okay. Oh, we're back here. Did I... Okay, so that was this area back here, right? Yeah. Um, we can't use the elevator. I feel like I'm missing one last number. I forget where it is. Um, what was the number again? Turn, turn, turn the numbers. Four, nine, seven, six. We're going to go with that. Then that is not a f one of those numbers is not what I think it is then. That could be a five. That could be a seven. That maybe could be a two and that is definitely a six at the end. I'm going to say it's five, nine, seven, six. Hopefully that's... It's not... Uh, let's try four. I thought this nine could be a two. This could be a one. That's definitely a six. Turn, turn, turn the numbers. Oh, it's a seven, uh, not a two. I was four, seven, two, six. Four, 
four seven two six four nine two six five seven okay got it okay this one is probably on one of my other notes diary from roof No, it's a secret. I'll give them something to deal with. It's demon shelters. No use of any more of my instrument. 2972. <laughs> Yay! It's hair! We love hair! There's nothing inside the box. No, I'm wrong. There are a few hairs inside. Pick up those hairs. You're gonna need. You're gonna need those hairs. You're gonna need them. Hairs are the currency in Silent Hill. There's something stuck in the drainage pipe. First time I saw it, I I know that's like whatever is supposedly supposed to be stuck in the drainage pipe, like whatever item that's stuck down there. I thought it was an ear. It looks like an ear to me. I don't care what anyone else says. It looks like just Van Gogh cut off his ear and just threw it down the drains pipe. Um. So we have this and this and you just pick it up. Good thing this hair is so thick that we found An elevator key. Um, let's go to the elevator. First floor, because we haven't been there yet. That section is cut off. Let's this door. Nope. This store, nope. That's the elevator we came from. The store. Ooh, what's that? Shotgun shells. A perfectly, a couple of perfectly good mattresses. I don't, I don't know anyone why you would waste them in just an unused asylum. Perfectly good. Uh, creepy ass dolls. Oh, they're sheriff bears? later. This is no place for a kid. There are all sorts of strange things around here. I can't believe you haven't even gotten a scratch on you. Why should I? Wait, wait. There's something I gotta get. Later. 
later, okay? But it's really important. What is it? A letter from Mary. Huh? I want to go get it. Is that okay? Yes. Yes. What are you doing, Laura? It's further back in the desk. Laura! What are you doing? I fell for the easiest trick in the book, my dude. Now you're gonna get weird oh, vagina monster. I you. Open the door, Laura. Why should I? I'm a liar, right? Want me to open it? Huh? Huh? Do ya? What's the magic word? Please? Laura? Uh, there's a box creature in here? It it's fucking dirty as shit. Uh. You snotty little brat! Open up! Why, you... you... Laura? How dare you call me a fart face, you little bitch? Okay. Uh, creepy feet monsters are heading towards us. I'm gonna do what any reasonable man would do and just blast them with my shotgun and hope. The game crashes a teeny bit when you you have them. Oh, there we go. Oh shit. We just no clip through the ceiling, as as we should. James. 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 And we just David Lynch transition outside. Okay, how very human. Um, it's too dark to read the map. One thing I always like pointing out that I think is just hilarious. The garden is so huge. We are in this tiny ass box. Cement box. And on the map, it's ginormous. I did think that was not intentional. Like, they accidentally just, like, fucked up on the map. And it was supposed to be huge. And they're just like, oh. We forgot to do that. And I think this is actually where I'm going to end. Because, uh... I want to go enjoy the rest of my birthday. I've had fun on stream. But I think it's... I think it's time to wrap it up. Thank you for joining me. I'm Vincent Thomas Short of Spooky CD-ROM, and uh, hope you're having a great day out there, and I want to try to have a great birthday, and hopefully I'll remember to pick up that ammo next time I come back, but I probably will immediately forget it exists. Until next time, guys. See ya, boyos. Goodbye.